What's going on, you guys? This is Ryan here again, and thank you, thank you, thank you. 1,000 to 2,000 subscribers did not take long at all. Only took about less than a month. And for your guys' uh, trouble for subscribing to me and always watching my videos, taking the time out of your day to see what I'm doing, see what's going on with my ultimate team, watching my pack openings, uh, I will be giving away three cards. And I'm thinking about doing this every uh, like halfway point to another 1,000 subs and then a big giveaway for the actual 1,000 uh, subscriber from the previous one so next giveaway will be 2,500 and then a big giveaway for 3,000 and so on and so on and so on just so there's like a schedule for how I do it um, right now though I'm going to show you the cards I don't have it organized I really wanted to get this out there right now because there's an actual serious side of this video coming up after this but I do want to let you guys know that first place will receive a well it's not a one star but it is a 99 Darrell Revis I don't know why the picture isn't showing up sometimes ultimate team is really slow but uh, Darrell Revis, uh, he's still going for a decent bit of coins, uh, not the absolute most. But uh, in terms of what I have right now in coins, I can't really um, give away what I want to give away. I want to save up some money for the playoff cards that are releasing tomorrow, the divisional round. Uh, really hoping for a two-star Patrick Willis, or three-star Patrick Willis, I should say. Um, but I'm not too sure that's going to happen. Maybe they'll do like Alden Smith or something. But uh, I really wish his picture would show up so you could see it. But oh well, Darrell Revis is going to be the first place winning card. Uh, for second place, we have a one star Gene Upshaw. Um, he is still going for a decent bit, probably like 25, 30k. But uh, I don't know, he's not at the price he used to be at, which was like 50, 60. Uh, maybe he'll go up, maybe he won't. With the release of all the new uh, Ghost offensive linemen and the draft duels coming back. There'll be chances to get like the Steve Hutchinson left guard, and maybe people will stop wanting Gene Upshaw. So right now, you can get him while he still has some decent value, and that'll be for the second place winner. And for the third place winner, uh, not the best card, but Cam Chancellor, which happens to not be showing its picture either. I don't know why it's doing this. Um, I kind of want to do the video over again, but you don't really need to see the picture. Uh, this is the Virginia Tech Campus Hero Reward. It gives plus one to jumping. Uh, he's really, really tall, about 6'3", has really high hit power and average stats across the board for his safety. Um, I mean, for people that watch my videos, uh, I don't really think a lot of people who have amazing teams watch like mine, London's, and Chase, and Josh's videos. And if you're watching and you just, you're casual, you like ultimate team, but you don't have the best team, this card should help you out a lot, as well as the Revis and the Gene Upshaw. So um, this is actually going to be the serious part of the video now. Um, oh yeah, I do want to say that I will be picking the winners for the giveaway probably after the playoff games on Saturday. So around Sunday, I'll have the video uploaded of the winners. All right, so now let's get on to the serious part of the video. Um, if you know, if people from the EA forums know me on there, uh, you'll know that I had a little bit of a, what's the word, like, I, I kind of went overboard with the way I was sort of like acting on the forums. I was going crazy on people, getting pissed off at people calling myself, London, and Josh, and Chase out, uh, saying that we're no more than YouTube, like basically fags, and we only post videos and stuff so people watch, and, and all this other stuff, basically saying that we shouldn't be on there, we don't deserve to be on there, we're... Uh, it just, it just, honestly, just a bunch of garbage to me, really. Like, we did not deserve that at all. We don't do anything that would cause people to act like that. I don't understand why people were doing that, but whatever. I actually got called out by someone named BMC, uh, Team BMC. And I know you're watching this video. And um, <clears throat> the whole situation was, I still find it funny how this card isn't showing up, but whatever. Uh, we'll go on to a good picture of an actual player that's really, really, really good. Where the hell is he? All right, Jerry Rice, and he ain't showing up either, so whatever. But um, the whole situation with uh, BMC, he called me out, called me and London out. He said, if you guys can beat, uh, if one of you guys can beat me, I will give you 500K. If you lose, you have to upload a video pretty much saying that you got owned by BMC or whatever. Just, there's just a bunch of random stuff that I, I couldn't believe that was being posted. And I'm just like, really? Like, I know that I'm actually really good at the game. And I'm like, okay, you want to talk shit to me, I'll play you. Like, I'll post a video, and I'll I'll post a video if I lose, but, a, but when I win, I expect the money. Now, me, 
being a really, really cocky individual, and I shouldn't be this way, and I, I'm admitting that I am, I didn't record the video. I was 100% sure that I would beat him, BMC. I was 100% sure I was going to beat him, and I just took it way too far. I got too fired up. I didn't record the video, and I lost. I lost by three points. It was an actual really good game. Uh, there was some issues that I had with the game, the way he was playing defense. I don't really like that. I don't like people dropping people in the coverage that much. But it's to each his own. However you play the game is however you play the game. He won fair and square. Uh, and I, like I said, I did not post the video. I didn't record it. And I felt pretty bad about it. And I sincerely 100% am sorry for not recording the video. I wish I had the video. I even wanted to play him right after. And I said if I lose, I'll definitely post it this time. If I win, I won't even post it because it's not fair to you. And uh, he declined, of course, which is which is fair because... I mean, who would want to play someone that didn't live up to a bet? And uh, I just want people to know that there is some times where I have a lot of anger issues. And it just it affects me in ways that I can't even explain. Like, I just go completely crazy on people. And I shouldn't act that way. And I really, really am sorry. The whole thing, I think, got blown out of proportion. Um, I don't really think we deserve the people that do the YouTube videos and around the forums. I don't think we deserve the type of hate we get. Uh, maybe I do in a, in a way because I actually took it way too far. I started arguing with everyone on the forums, calling people out, saying I can't stand all these kids and stuff. But it just it really is part of my anger issues. I had to actually take classes in school, uh, like mediation and stuff, because I was just going absolutely crazy on people all the time. And I've kind of cooled down with it, but when that happened and I was getting called out and I knew I wasn't doing anything wrong, it really got to me. And I'm being 100% serious. I am sorry for this. And if you can accept my apology, that would be great. But uh, that's pretty much it, guys. The 2,000 subscriber giveaway will be uh, picked for the winners on Sunday, like I said. And um, that's pretty much it. So, yeah, peace.